everybody, this is Sinning Chong here, and we're back on playing Crush Cross Season 1, Episode 3. It turns out, I know I've been a little working going on, and just a uh, thinking schedule, but I know uh, Lumen Legacy Update hasn't updated it yet, because Athletic... And... Was it Atlas City is still not yet, it, it didn't came out yet, so... It's gonna be the same thing as Sephirite City, but I'm pretty sure. And we got a new girl going on, and her name is Esper. I I did not even expect that uh one, but looks kind of interesting. But yeah, and I think we're gonna do Generico on. It looks like a. It doesn't seem to show with a face, so let's do Generica. With blushing confidence, you approach your high school crush, Generica, and give her a love note confessing your feelings. It works! She has a crush on you, too. Oh, oh no, wait. Uh oh. You agree to meet up later under the Sakura trees for a date. As you leave a cold wind cold a cold wind blows rush rustling the flower petal flower petals rival for senpai crush stabbed oh oh no oh no poor generica strangely generica doesn't not show up later for your date after waiting an hour you accept that she must not have felt the same way for you. As you leave, you bump into another girl. Um, uh, Jasper, I got a bad feeling about this. Just be careful, Jasper. I have no idea where she- Oh, you're just saying hi. Oh my. Hi. Hello. Hey. Uh... Hi? M maybe I'll see you around sometime, senpai. Uh, wait. Oh, Ayato, wait. Um, hold on. Is she from a Yandere Simulator? Okay. Oh, hello, Senpai. I was just thinking about you. I mean, just for a moment, not like all day or anything. Hmm, maybe Jasper agree. Um, I have to go. I have a dentist appointment right now. Goodbye. Um. But why can't I do anything right? I wish I were dead! Oh, hello, Senpai. I was just rehearsing for the school play. Shakespeare, I think. Right, gotta go. Oh. Uh, um, Jasper, I'm gonna. I'm not sure this is okay for you, Jasper. You agree? I hate pointless emails so much. Why do people send so many pointless emails? They actively sabotage my goodwill. Hmm. Um. Maybe? They talk. You sure do know a lot of girls, Senpai. I hope they don't bother you all the time with pointless drama. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. I saw that with a picture frame, Ayato. Oh my god. Uh, Five flowers. Okay. Senpai, you're here. Did you drop by... Just to chat with me? Yeah, Jasper agrees. Oh, oh my god. Um, I... I gotta go. I'll be back. Wait here. No, wait. Don't do that. Um, please excuse me. Uh... Box cutter is a great name for a tool. Because there's all sorts of boxes you can cut with it. Oh, jeez. Uh... Uh, okay. One... Okay, let's just give one, like, Sweet Jesus, Ayato! <laughs> I love the night. It's so much easier sneaking up on people in the darkness. Sorry, uh, wrong name. Whoops, Ayato. Okay, skip that already. Oh my god. Yep. I'm sorry I freaked out so bad the last time he spoke like this. Do you... Do you want to be friends? Yeah, Jasper agrees. Just our friend. Oh, how wonderful! 
I mean, I love making friends. Good friends are what make life worth living. Hmm. I wore my hair up today. But if you hate it, I can tear it down. Or off. You know, whatever. Okay, uh... Uh, beach. Okay, let's see, beach. She just ate the crab, oh my god. I love fresh crab. Especially crabs that see too much. Stuff that's none of their business. Yeah, I I didn't eat crabs. I don't like crabs because it makes me uncomfortable. So, uh, skip that. So, the other day, a certain girl who I won't name asked me if I had a crush on you. Isn't that crazy? Um, Jennifer, I'm not sure either. I mean, could you imagine if I had a crush on you and thought about you all the time and dreamt about you at night? So embarrassing. Okay. Do you ever have dreams that inspire you to change your life and dedicate it to a single purpose for the rest of eternity? Aren't they romantic? Wait, okay, uh, 20 sex scenes. Did you see that pigeon? They freak me out. I feel like they might take over the world someday. Oh, oh my god, Ayato. Ayato. No. My goodness, uh, 50 the designer bags. Do you think, Senpai, that we could maybe go out sometime? I mean, just as friends. I mean, what else would we go as? Goldfish? <laughs> um, wait. Goldfish. Oh. oh, wait. Isn't that, uh, Cole just ate a goldfish? I just realized that one. Okay. Yeah, just we're agreed. Great! Let's say maybe tonight? I'll pack us a snack, and we can walk around in the moonlight, like a pair of great friends. Yeah... Um... How's my favorite 103-pound, 4-foot, 2-inch birthmark on the right heel, little munchkin? Okay. Okay, uh... 20 movie theater. What a great movie! I'm sure glad nobody talks during it. That makes me so mad! Oh my... Oh my goodness! Uh, yeah? No. Oh my god, uh... I'm pretty sure Ayano is Yandere, oh my god. <laughs> okay, uh... 50... New colors? Do you know what's a weird word? Girlfriend. I mean, I'm a girl, and I'm your friend. So that sort of makes me a girlfriend, right? Yeah, Jasper agrees, but if you heard Jasper, I'll, I'll literally got you on your side. Yay! I mean, yeah, language is weird. Thanks for helping me clear that up. Alright. I wore my lucky panties today. <laughs> no, 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 not my get lucky panties, you silly. Um, no thanks. <laughs> Senpai, do you like me? Yeah, just where it agrees. You noticed me. Oh, Senpai, you've made me so happy. I love you, I love you, I love you! Yeah, uh, I hope a uh, Yandere Simulator update would get a full edition one. That would be pretty intense one. Let's skip class today and lie in bed. I'll make you lunch. We can do whatever you want. Alright, and Ayato's done. Okay, we gotta find Generica. Okay, where's Generica? Ah, there it is! Okay. This is when this girl was killed by Ayato. And this one, she become the ghost. So we gotta do Generica again. Knowing that Generica is counting on you, you decide to prevent the natural order and perform a dark service to raise her for the dead placing your phone on the ocean board you call upon her spirit and all the laws of nature and science crush oh gosh oh generica emerged for the board not so much race for the dead she is a very scary and reached for your hand, sending chills up your spine. Your ghostly girl pulls back 
her hand, realize she is still very much terrifying. Looks like you have to find another way to restore her to her life. Good luck with that. Creepy ghost sounds. Okay, um... Uh, okay, 54,311... 311 shells. You are still trying to save me? Well, uh, yeah, uh, Jasper's gonna fix it. Jasper agreed. Sweet. Alright. Boo. Aw. Okay, uh. Okay. A lot of eight numbers of roses. You are starting to run away, Les. Um. Alright. Next. I'm going to squeeze the life out of you in a nice way. Okay. Chocolates, here we go. I think about you every day and night. <laughs> no, just I'm gonna get freak you out. Okay, that's where say yes. And pancakes for some reason. Okay. Must not crawl out of TV. Oh jeez, she gives me freaks me out every time. God, okay. Earrings, earrings. No! Oh jeez. <laughs> you make Jasper freaks out. Okay. I want to be human again. I want to stand by yeah, Jasper agreed. I'm trying. Sen. Hi. Alright. How are you today? Oh. Uh, maybe? Okay, uh. 33 Moonlight Stroll. I hope I didn't scare you. I can look a little extra. spooky at night. Not many ghost stories take place during the day, hey? Alright. Okay, um... A lot of one... of flowers. Thank you. You're welcome, okay, uh... I think... I'm getting better at speaking normally again. Do you... Uh, um... Do you think you could keep helping me? Yeah, yeah, Jasper agrees. Uh, he's gonna fix you up. Thank. I mean, thank you. Please continue to help me, Senpai. <laughs> Do you mind me calling you that? It makes me smile. Yeah, just call him Yellow Dog Eye. His favorite nickname, okay? I think I'm starting to get the hang of this friendly ghost stuff. Cats have stopped hissing at me, and holy water only burns a smidge! Oh jeez, uh... Uh, 66 feet? I sort of miss feeling the ocean, but at least I never have to worry about drowning. <laughs> Yay! Silver linings! <laughs> oh please, don't drown! You make Je- You make Jess gonna get scared now, okay, uh... Spot cakes? Promise not to haunt this for all eternity. Yeah. <laughs> I would. Yeah, I would. <laughs> Just don't make Jasper freaks out. Okay? Promise? Alright. Hey, sweetie! You'll be happy to hear that I didn't haunt, spook, or creep anyone today. Pretty great, huh? Yeah. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go crawl out of a well. Don't ask. It's a ghost thing. Yikes, no. Senpai! I tried to make you some food before you got here, but possessing a stove isn't as easy as you'd think. Oh yeah, uh, you have a magic, I think. Uh, 99 sexy. I remember autumn days. The chill in the air, the sound of leaves. 
pumpkin spice lattes. Ah, those were the days. Oh god, uh, oh, wind blow. Alright, um, enchanted scarf. Here we go. Oh, senpai, this is so very kind. I wonder if we destroy it, will it turn into a ghost itself? Should we try? Uh, I don't know that will work, um... Yeah, Jessica doesn't know either. Okay, uh... I just can't stop thinking about how well we would fit together if I was whole. Your arm would fit perfectly around my waist. Yeah. That's very great. Isn't it neat how some people can seem like they're... made for each other? If only... You know... I just noticed how much cats and ghosts have in common! We're both mostly nocturnal, we're low-key dangerous, and we knock stuff over when we don't get enough attention! Hmm... <laughs> Alright! <laughs> That's pretty nice. Okay. Whoa! Whoa, a lot of shoes! Oh my goodness! Um... Okay, 123 movie theater. I love that movie! Especially when the boy ghost possesses the lady psychic and makes out with the pretty girl! <sighs> so romantic! Huh. Right. Huh, okay. A lot of shoes. Here we go. You spoil me, senpai! I wish I could buy you gifts in return, but none of the stores are accepting my ghost credit cards. Oh, poor Generica. <laughs> hey. The next time it snows, let's make some snowmen. Then I'll haunt them and have them chase people. <laughs> Won't that be fun? All right, we gotta. I know things are a little rough right now. But next Halloween, we are going to win all the costume contests. Yeah, Jasper agrees. You can dress up as a Ghostbuster if you'd like. But be aware that the term Ghostbuster is a bit of a double entendre. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, just be careful, Generica. I overheard someone say they got ghosted, and I kind of find that term offensive. The point of ghosts is that we don't go away. So rude. Right. Oh, wait, is that a potion? Um, okay, I'm gonna get her. You spoil me, senpai! I wish I could buy you gifts in return, but none of the stores are accepting my ghost credit cards. So you're saying, if this magic potion works, I might be alive again, and we can be together? Oh, senpai! I'm so nervous! What if it doesn't work? Alright, bring it across, Jasper. Alright, there it goes. I... I feel strange. Oh my gosh! Are those... Are those legs? Oh! Did she just turn back into human? Ouch! I ran into the wall again. Of all the things I have to get used to being alive again, I didn't expect common sense to be one of them. And Generica's done! Hey! She turned human again! That was nice. Okay. We... We gotta do these two. Uh, we have Bon Jovi and Spectrum. Alright, let's do Bon Jovi. Once again, you heard the calling a... C calling to become a Monster Girl Master. And that's because Dr. Wood is calling you on your cell phone again in the middle of the night. Hey there, fella. Dr. Wood slurs. This one's a fish. Don't shag her back. He begins to say something about getting her water, but then tumbles down a flight of stairs. Which makes sense, mermaids should definitely be kept in the water. I don't want to say that, that's a constantly one. What the heck is that? Childhood, childhood doubts about even meeting a real life mermaid princess crush. Wait, is that a bomber now? The mermaid looks at you with oofy oof. Yeah, cut that language. No, no, no. 
either that or she'll be hydrated. Better safe than sorry, you rush to take her to the ocean. Yeah, I gotta read that. <laughs> Rude. You do that to Jester's pants. One. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay. Pop. Then she hiccups. Wait, I realized that's a Little Mermaid reference. Um, T said. Yeah. Nice, Jasper. Oh, she has a starfish on her head, not head. Oh, that's cute, but uh, the starfish just could literally stare at your soul. Oh my god. Okay, 500 flowers. Why? <laughs> okay, um... Okay, 15... Moonlight Stroll? Okay, gotta read first. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just... Couldn't stop laughing about saying dope and sounds. Okay. 15 Moonlight Strolls, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, don't hug Jasper, okay? Uh, 100,000 drinks. No. Okay, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, 20 feet. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That reference looks like a little mermaid. Yeah, a little mermaid reference. Okay, 100 new cars. Oh, jeez, why did you eat it, Bunch Oh my god! Wait. Yeah. You yeah, you yeah. are. Okay, uh... Well, the same thing? Okay. Let me find side scenes, alright. Oh, um... I'm gonna put it on this video. Whoops. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's true. Stay hydrated, please. Okay. 10,000 necklace. He's gonna give 10,000 necklace. You are. Nice, okay, uh, top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, yeah, Jasper agrees that.
yourself. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, okay, but that's okay. We got a uh, safe for work content, which is okay. Okay. Dirty movie theater. Yeah. All right. Dirty movie. Yeah. Okay. Magic handle. How thoughtful. Okay, uh... Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, uh... 300... reset boost. That's okay, because we got that. I got Jasper with me. All right. Top. Really? Okay. Yeah. What? Yeah. And Mo Chobi is done. All right. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this is making unsettling, you guys. Okay. Uh, the last one, Spectrum. In the next episode, our heroes learns an important lesson in friendship, and always doing your best no matter what. They also learn some interesting things about Centaur, Amatho, and. Nah, Yeah. God darn! God darn it! She kicked me into a boof right on that coin punch. I'm black out. I'm blacking out. Thought the wood appears to collapsing. I believe because his brain is so big. There, there's a half girl, half horse here, sir. So, this is probably the monster girl Dr. Wood wants helping examining. Sensing adventure, your oof her to follow you home. Dr. Wood's coin purse crushed. Oh! There are, there are a lot of mysteries to uncover it. Cover when it comes to centaurs. That's right. We're gonna find out together. I'm right here, Jasper. I'll protect you. Okay, uh, 1,000 flowers. <laughs> I shouldn't do reading first and then taking in gifts. Whoops. <laughs> Why did you poke just as good? Oh jeez, Jasper, I think you're gonna have a bad day sometimes. Mm. Alright. Okay. 20 cakes. Mm. Yeah. Oh, that was nice. Yep. Yeah. Okay, uh... 20... Okay. 20 moonlight struck. Okay. 
30. Okay, Jasper's got, uh, 30,000 plus. Oh. Okay, uh... <laughs> uh good job, Jess. Okay, 25 feet. Oh goodness, uh, <laughs> there's a crab right there! Oh yeah, uh, just don't get a sunburn. Okay, 40,000 tea set. That's nice, okay, uh... Uh, how about later? Just a stays later. Hey. Alright. Yeah. Okay, uh... Okay, 30 sightseeing. Yeah. Oh god, um... Oh dear. Digits. Um, I think I, um, probably a uh, Ayato kills Pigeon. Okay, um, uh, yeah, I, I saw a Genshin Impact player just killing Timmy's Pigeons, which is like never that one. Okay, uh, 80,000 shoes. <laughs> Oh, it's the same thing, okay. Why did you just steal Justice hat? Oh my god, uh, 35 movie theater? <laughs> Alright, um... No. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh... 100,000 kill puppy! <laughs> Idea for Jasper to carry on your back. That drone. Okay. Nay. Nay. And Spectrum's done. All right. Okay, I think that will be pretty sure. Alright, uh, let's do Foom. Wondering why it's experimenting with the generation mechanism for mass and gradual bonus a technonic condensation event. According an interfered, with a consulary feel of a bearing translucian time machine feel corrupt flex compactoring crush stating any the plot of in the light cone of model earth 
You began to apologize on behalf of 21st century science. Uh, uh oh. Computer simulations project your danger rating at approximately 8%. You pose less danger than room. We can converse. Yeah, Jasper agrees. Just don't hit him. I am stranded in this century until further notice. I require your assistance. For science. Oh, okay. I noticed you have maintained a degree of civility despite my hostile tone. Am I to interpret this as not from a lack of fortitude, but is intentional? Yeah, Jasper agreed. It appears to be rather significant effort on your part. But I admit to preferring you now than you were before. Right. I have observed you on several outings with other feminine individuals. Please advise me how to conduct my own outings with them. Okay, uh, 25 drinks. You remain the singular source of consistency in my interactions with this time period. Can I depend on your continued support? Yeah, Jasper agreed. Excellent. You possess many desirable attributes in a lab partner. I look forward to discovering more. Right. I find considerable mirth in the existential crisis provoked by attempting to reconcile free will with the determinative nature of physics. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, 25 plush toy. I need to increase overall favorability with you in order to perform several crucial experiments. Do you object? Uh, yeah, just would say yes. Excellent. We are now considered friendly rivals. I look forward to increased relational tension in our interactions. Yeah, I just don't like Jasper freaks out. I find considerable mirth in the existential crisis provoked by attempting to reconcile free will with the determinative nature of physics. <laughs> All right. Man, that was a cool friend zone picture. That was nice. Okay, uh. 10 million stroke. Oh god, I don't want to get a really speed up ahead. Um, just one. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, what? Our activities were satisfactory. Thank you for your participation. Okay, um, uh, 10 shoes? This object pleases my aesthetic standards. It is almost a shame to use it as fuel in my experiments. Okay, uh... Whoop. You are a valued contributor to my reconnaissance. We should spend more time interacting on... personal matters. Yeah, that's very great. I would be interested in performing several experiments on your body. I find it rather fascinating. Mm. There is a primitive charm to your civilization. I hope you do not self-destruct before reaching higher on the Kardashev scale. Oh jeez, um... Okay, uh... One... Oh, are you looking at a crystal or something? Our outing has left me with more questions than answers. Thank you for covering the monetary costs of the expedition. Alright. Hey, Nicholas? What a fascinating gesture. You appear to be conducting some sort of mating ritual. I will spare this object for my experiments. Alright. Are you attempting to initiate courtship? You are aware that I am only a rank 7 feminine librarian assassin, right? Um. Um, definitely not sure either, but. Uh, we're definitely not sure either. You. Flatter me. I do not rebuff your advances. Please, initiate courtship level Delta. Oh. I am surprised that my lack of a third breast has not turned you off your courtship rituals. Is it still the norm then in this century? Okay. <laughs> One sec. Oh, she's looking like that, sir? I have collected significant data on courtship rituals. I must return to my domicile and get hands-on with the results. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, fight designer bags? Inspiring. I felt a surge of heart palpitations at the sight of this object, not unlike the brushing of a butterfly's wings. I believe I may be ill. Uh... 
you should, yeah, uh, why don't you just take a relax on the bedroom, okay? Your presence stimulates me. My heart rate increases and my pheromone protection spikes dramatically. Are you doing that on purpose? Uh, Jeffrey says no. It's too bad that weaponized sexiness was outlawed by the Geneva Commandments of 2135 CE. You would make an incredible weapon. Uh... Yeah. Odd. I was staring at your gluteus maximus, but without the aid of my glassware scanners. What a delightful waste of time. Right, okay, um... Uh... Wait, uh, why are you... Watching you instead of a movie maker? What the heck? I am left with a sense of anticipation for our next interaction. I will see you in my REM sleep tonight. Alright. Tune apart? I understand now the meaning of these gestures. Thank you. You are accurately interpreting my material desires. Alright. I am not interested in meeting the requirements for a monogamous pairing. However, if you would like to initiate a more intimate designation, I would not object. Yeah, that's where it would. Very well. We shall take the neutral terminology of girl and friend and create a compound word implying essentially the opposite. Yeah. My glasswares allow me to see individuals without clothing. Your physical form is nice, but pales in comparison to Bonnebelle's. Uh, excuse me, how did you know about Bonnebelle? And please don't look at Jasper on set of one, okay? Uh, I am submitting an application for the Joint Initiation of Intimate Congress, subject to approval of pre-existing physical requirements and standards. Access granted. My garment security passcode is... Megane Ko. Do your worst. Okay, Jasper's gonna remind that. Your internet is so inundated with entitlement that there's a 98% chance this dialogue will offend someone. Oh, wait, uh, I don't know... No, she has a... Something on her back, okay? Okay, film is done. Oh. Oh. Great, I'm gonna... <laughs> Jess is gonna ready to date Beverly. Oh boy. Let's go. One night while you're out partying with friends and enemies, you decided to spay, spice things up with your favorite beer, uh, bear joke. Not noticing, not noticing the beautiful bear lady in the corner of the room. Ribs, crush. Oh, it appears that you have often heard the care of bear feelings. Perhaps you should try to smooth, smooth things over. Once you regain consideredness. Uh, yeah, Jasper. Be brave. Beverly can see you are sorry. Beverly's mama raised her right. She believe in forgiveness. <laughs> what the heck? What's with the Beverly's voice? may be used in lieu of conversation, words will always retain their power. Oh jeez, okay. Barely appreciate your efforts. Her heart not made of stone, it made of bare gold. We can't stop laughing, what the heck? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jennifer agrees. Barely no longer feel like mauling you. It's large improvement. All right. Beverly is omnivore! We'll eat anything but gluten! <laughs> okay, <laughs> 50 chocolates! Beverly notice you around! Like buzzing bee when Beverly eat honey and larva! Is coincidence? Yeah, Jasper agrees. Beverly is fine with this! Just don't make too much noise! Beverly is easily spooked! Uh, oh, oh, what's wrong with her Beverly's arm right there? Barely thinking about getting perm! Okay, um... 50 cakes. You are friendly, like foolish tourist! But Barely does not feel like gnawing on your leg! Friends? 
Yeah, just Jasper's friend. Yay! Beverly has made a new friend! Oh, Rapture! Right. Beverly thinking about getting perm! Okay. <laughs> okay. What? Uh. Beverly is happy! Despite resting bareface! Okay, uh. Can I find. He said? So cute! Beverly will store in cave! Okay, uh. Beverly likes smell of you! Can Beverly smell you more often? <laughs> Uh, yeah, just a bit. Once. Just a bit. Always best to ask permission! Alright. Beverly, always walk around barefoot! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see what speech. Oh, uh. Where did the phone go? And oh, oh god, uh, Beverly got the crab right there. So much romance! It is like barely full of larva! Oh, Beverly ate it. Oh, okay, uh, can I fight two puppies? Wazards! Beverly's heart is filled with happy! Okay, Beach. You make Beverly feel shy, like Pretty Bunny in Little Burrow. Do you feel like Bunny too? Yeah, uh, just for what? Beverly is happy! She wants to roll in grass and other smells! <laughs> Beverly wants to be treated like pretty princess! <laughs> um. Oh, uh, Beverly, uh, be careful while you're eating the leaves. Wow! Let's go again soon! Okay. Nicholas? Beverly's so humbled! I'm speechless! Okay. Beverly has many bear hugs to give! Take extras for later! Alright. Beverly, try not to break fragile marshmallow bones! Remind her you are not bear! Yeah, uh, just be careful about Jester's bones, okay? Bears are most loyal animal! <laughs> okay, I don't know what am I doing with dating a bear, <laughs> okay? <laughs> oh, poor Jasper. Okay. Whoa, uh, that's quite too tall. Beverly enjoys movies! Okay, uh, 10 designer bags. You are thoughtful! It is a good thing! Alright. Beverly wants Rubens! Oh, jeez. Yay! Beverly never so happy before! Yeah, <laughs> you're right, Jasper. I think you'll be all right. Oh, I'm hopeless romantic. Love is like salmon leaping into mouth. All right. Uh. Oh, potion. Oh wait. Oh, this is the potion for Generica has. Okay, give one. You are thoughtful. It is a good thing. All right. Beverly wants to nuzzle you forever. Yeah, that's where it goes. Just, uh, just softly. This is greatest bear romance in history! Yeah. Beverly was smelling flowers when bees sting her nose. I hate bees! Okay, uh, wow. I, she changed into a, a human, okay? All right, and Beverly's done. Um, she changed to human. That's nice, um... Let me see. Mm. Uh, we don't know. We did a bit, so yeah, we gotta do Charlotte. One day, while digging around in the creepy cemetery, you get sort of bored and start practicing your button twirling with your shovel. Things are going spectacular until you attempt a fun side figure and turn twice reverse. Flash Pine will fumble the toss and mysterious corrupted crypt crushed. Oh, oh no, Jasper, why'd you broke it? 
he destroyed the seal on the creepy crops, revealing a rather pale gothic girl, complete with a scrumptiously unsettling doll. You ruined my living burial. How unfortunate. I guess I'll have to find something else to do today. Oh jeez, uh... Well, she has a bunny rabbit! Well, I'm not sure, um, Sailor looks like... I'm not sure if she's a little bit of base of Alice, I think. I'm not sure about this. I guess I should look on the dark side. Things could have been better. Oh jeez, um... Oh, Satan Rose! <laughs> wow, okay. 666 Rose? Please tell me you intend to follow up your grave crushing with a bit more weight. I'm not some one-night tragedy kind of woman. Uh, Tedra's not. Excellent. I'd hate to waste good funeral attire. Alright, sorry about that. So what exactly is your plan here? Do you just walk around graveyards for fun, or do you have more nefarious purposes? Uh, um, Jesper, not sure either. But I think a bit. Really? Hmm, maybe there's more to you than meets my eye. Maybe. Oh yeah, uh... Hmm. What disappointment are you bringing me today? Okay. Wow. Uh, 666 earrings. You're a little too bright for my tastes. But Lilith sees some proper darkness in your soul. So, I'll trust her. Uh, who's, who's Lilith? I don't know who is she. Lilith, my bunny! So insensitive. Perhaps she's right about you after all. Oh! Oh, Bunny Flush. Right, right. Mother of Crows is a little on the nose, don't you think? I prefer more subtlety to my darkness. Okay, uh... Okay, a lot of cake. Next time you want to give me something like... Crows are classic foreboding creatures, but nothing's more cute than the malevolence of a spider, don't you think? Uh, yeah, uh... By the way, uh, Jester's afraid of spiders. Just don't let Jester freaks out. Great! My friends Itzy and Bitsy would agree with you! Oh, okay, uh... Just be careful about Jasper, okay? Quick! Rats or bats? What's your favorite? Oh, wow, okay! Okay, um... Whoa, that's a lot of Satan numbers, okay, uh... Just like Poe! Okay... 666, Moonlight... What a lovely date! Though I was hoping, with the full moon, that we might get mauled by a werewolf. Okay. Okay. A lot of teeth. I have to admit, this is adorable. It's so unsettling. <laughs> Alright, uh... Friends cover for you, but best friends help you bury the body. Are you in? Yeah, Jasper agrees. Oh, good! Lilith is no help whatsoever with a shovel. <laughs> Alright. Destruction is beauty. Clearly, you are wrecking me. Okay, uh... A lot of beach? I think Lilith has a crush on those massive tentacles. She loves being squeezed. Oh god, no! No, 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 no! Uh-oh. <laughs> no thanks. No thanks, Charlotte. No thanks. <laughs> okay. Okay, Jasper's brought uh, a lot of shoes. This is great! But, if you don't mind... I'm going to pretend it's nothing, so Lilith doesn't feel replaced. Uh, right, okay, um... Uh. My morose morsel of a marshmallow. I think I'm falling for you. Are you falling too? Yeah, Jasper's agrees, uh, a bit. Oh, wonderful! I do hope it's a long drop with a sudden stop. Right. Destruction is beauty. Clearly, you are wrecking me. Okay, uh... Okay, a little bit of sight. All those leaves sacrificed to the uncaring wind. Would you sacrifice me like that one day? Oh, That's nice. Right, um... Lola Necklace? Wow! You see the Grim in the most unique places! Alright. <laughs> yeah, uh... Jasper feels happy about that, okay? Talk. I'm not normally into sports. But I'd be willing to try tonsil hockey. Interested in a game? No. Uh, maybe? Excellent! When it takes all the tonsils! 
Right. Of all the graveyards in the world, you walked into mine. Oh god. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay. A lot of movie theater. I can't believe you took me to a horror movie. The part where they lived happily ever after. So scary. Oh god. Uh. Yeah. Hmm. I play Robot Scary Elevator. I a bit. Yeah, because uh the update one. I tried to collect other badge because of the updated. And these guys are not happy. A little bit unhappy about the scary elevator of Roblox. Yeah, uh, magic candle. I do enjoy knowing you hurt your wallet for me. Okay, but that's okay. We have a lot. Okay. Do you have what it takes to light a fire in my heart? Mm. Yeah, Jasper would. Excellent. I'll get the matches. I can't wait to emulate. Yep. You are just adorably disturbing. Okay, um... Oh my god, that's a lot! Wow, wow, okay, uh... Chet and Scarf. I do enjoy knowing you hurt your wallet for me. Alright. You may swoon over me and kiss my arm a hundred times, if you want. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> True. Can we stay up until 3 a.m. reading dark poetry with Lilith, Itzy, and Bitsy? I need to recharge. Uh, yeah, just for what, dude, is this challenge, okay? Talk. Hold me so tight, I scream. What? Uh, is it a... Oh, wait, is it? What? Never mind, I come in with Tarp's kind of things going on. Sunlight! Crazy. Mm, what? Mystics. I do enjoy knowing you hurt your wallet for me. When I think of all the ways a person can be miserable in this world, I can't imagine anything worse than being with you. Yeah, just just as friend. Magnificent. Let's be lonely little spiders together forever. Right. Would you massage my feet? The itching powder is just on the shelf there. Okay. <laughs> and Charlotte's done. Right. Okay. Um. Uh, oh my goodness. Um. Uh, right. Last one, Nina. Now that you're truly in, you decide it's time to hire a submarine butler to help. Keep your house tidy and your schedule on track. Suddenly, a fiery maid busts into the room, slamming her resume, resumed on the table. All of the other butlers scatter to the wind. Interviewed, crushed. This fiery list has completely crushed this interview. You should probably hire her and develop a pitiful and flirty relationship with her. I think you'll find the credentials to be an order bus. Also, I look pretty great in a pair of heels. Um. That's the way. Think of me as a personal assistant you can practice your line pickup lines on. Okay. You have the scariest tax return I have ever seen. Why do you have so many jobs? How do you have so many jobs? Are you daft? Uh, yeah, uh, Jezra has a lot of jobs going on. <laughs> well, I can't argue with billions of dollars. Not really. I've tried. It's time consuming. Yeah. I would shoot you a nasty look, but I see you've already got one. Oh no, I didn't. No. <laughs> okay, new car. You've made quite a bit of progress. I dare say you might even be quite the catch. Are you feeling fishy? Yeah. Great! Channel your inner sturgeon. Embrace the tuna in your heart. Or whatever. I might be drunk. Oh. Really? Bonnie Bell dropped off some cookies for you. I ate them. I have no regrets. 
Mm. Oh yeah, uh, this is Anand's sister or cousin? I don't know what that is. Um, I can't tell what Anand's sis Anand's siblings. I don't know what that is. Um, okay, uh, two new cars. All right, this is the part we progressed to the friend zone. Are you feeling friendly? Yeah, Jasper agrees. Sorry, that was lame. I'm not one for getting all shined and your. If I'd had my way, we'd already be at third base or so. Oh well. Yeah. Hmm. Bonnie Bell dropped off some cookies for you. I ate them. I have no regrets. All right. All right. Um. Uh... Okay, lunch roll. <laughs> I'm not used to moonlit strolls fully clothed. Call me old fashioned, I suppose. Alright, uh... Another new car? Great! More clutter for me to dust. Just kidding. Um... Nice work there, boss. Now we're right and proper enamored. Now I can start up with the inappropriate puns. Um... Just don't do that, okay? A fine tradition stretching back to the beginning of the modern age. Right. I was going over your last will and testament and added the request to avenge your death to your next weekend. Okay. One beach. Oh, you have a floaty with you. Well, your plan worked. You've seen me bikini clad. I hope it lived up to your expectations. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh my god. Why do you always want to get new cars? What the heck? You posh wanker. Don't you got anything better to do with your unusual will? Alright. Well, I double check the employment agreement. And there's nothing in there about not flirting with the staff. This is crucial information. Yeah, Jasper would. Well, now you know. And knowledge is power. I washed your socks. What the hell have you been using them for? Um. Yeah, Jasper is doing to make a warm feed because it's pretty cold outside. Okay, one something. Oh, you have a coffee. It's too bad you couldn't invite a few gals on the same date. These supposedly free trips are brutal on your bank account. Okay. All right, you've got taste, I admit it. Get off my face. Yeah, but I don't know why you want to get so many new cars, but I don't know why. Can you explain it to me? <laughs> You're becoming quite a little charmer, aren't you? Let me guess. You've been practicing in the mirror. Um, yeah. A bit, Jasper. So yes, a bit. <laughs> oh, I can tell because you keep looking at me navel like you're making eye contact. I'm up here, slick. No. <laughs> I polished your car today. Wax on, wax off. All that delightful in your window. Right. Okay, uh, my god, you, why you always want to get a new car? <laughs> okay, movie theater. That movie was so testosterone packed. I was expecting to leave with a moustache. Let's go see it in 3D. Okay. <laughs> oh crap, you're starting to buy me things alike. I'm going to expense this under miscellaneous. Made you a little snack, boss. And if you're hungry for dessert, I'm sure we could whip something up for you. Yeah, Jasper would. I'll go get the whipped cream. Yeah, just don't forget to add... Yeah, just something and uh, sprinkles if you want. Need a wing woman tonight? Alright, I'll go pick up a new cocktail dress and some heels. Alright, new got Ah oh, crap, you're starting to buy me things alike. I'm going to expense this under miscellaneous and blame your poor impulse control. Okay, uh... Oh dear, professional hazard. Turns out I'm starting to fancy ya! Was this all part of your diabolical plan? Yeah, that's very great. Well, hook, line and sinker, you mangy charmer. Good day to you. Looking for a partner in crime today? Well, I'm ready when you are. And finally, Neon's done. Yeah, I think that was it on... Crush Crush Season 1 Episode 3 game. So, thanks for watching. I hope I I will give a little 
breaking the sketch out going on. So, I'll see you later, guys. Goodbye!